it's just a relief now. I mean, sorry. Kim Pace Heinley lost her online identity and she just got it back. We FaceTimed her in Statesboro and confirmed that we finally convinced Facebook to take down her stolen profile. It's just a relief knowing that I don't have to worry. I don't have to worry about my name being smeared. Nearly a year ago, an online identity thief hacked her profile and used Kim's identity to commit fraud. She reported it, but Facebook did nothing. Pictures were destroyed. My writings were destroyed. So Kim gave up and started a new profile, but the identity thief got access to her network of 2,000 friends. He used her identity to post phony appliances, furniture, and pet listings on Marketplace and then ask for payments in advance. Here's the problem for adults and kids who can't get access to their accounts. Facebook and Instagram show how to report stolen profiles, but they are not required to respond, unlike the credit bureaus. If someone steals your identity and opens a credit card in your name, you can dispute it and the bureaus have 30 days to respond. But I am not selling anything. Kim spent six months fighting, and it took us another three to stop a scam that nearly ruined Kim's reputation. I don't have to look on Facebook anymore or a friend call me and say, you know, are you selling something or, or threatening my life? I mean, my life has been threatened through all this. And I'm grateful. I'm grateful, Harry. I'm really grateful. There's only one me on there now. And I'm so grateful.